So you've been wanting to get your coffee fixed, but the nearest shop is a drive away and you're quite bored of your instant coffee. Well, today we'll talk about how to get delicious nitrogen infused iced coffee and what options you have to make a satisfying glass even better. So get ready because it's munch time. <laughs> It's time for Lockdown Munchies, your guide to the yummiest goodies this side of the community quarantine. My name is Mick Storage, and like you, I'm a fan of good food and fun drinks. And we've been talking a lot about Tasty Grove this past few weeks, so why don't we enjoy a good beverage this time? Trendy drinks have been a staple worldwide, and people just can't get enough of them. But while every other person lines up for hours just to get a sip of the latest craze, some just prefer to take a look at them and head to his or her favorite coffee shop for a nice cup of joe. Coffee has been the drink of choice for people who need the jolt and set their minds straight for different tasks. But some prefer to have it just because they like the taste or it gives them the kick they need to carry on with their day. Like it hot or cold, coffee is one beverage that has proven it has the staying power to reinvent itself time and again. Guys started to put some ice, maybe blend the coffee instead of spoon mixing it, add flavors, mix-ins, nitrogen, whip, what? Go back a little bit. Add flavors, mix-ins, nitrogen, 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 yes! Get your chemistry sets, kids, we're learning about nitrogen. Nitrogen is an element with the atomic number seven, colorless, odorless, and a lot more things we shall not get into. But I will tell you that adding it to coffee has its benefits. For one, it improves the taste of regular coffee. A theory suggests that nitrogen infusion slows down the degradation process of coffee, giving it less of a bitter aftertaste and letting it hit those sweeter notes, and adds a silky smooth finish to the drink. You don't have to imagine it, guys. Nitrogen-infused coffee is available here in the Philippines. Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea Bar. They're the first to offer nitrogen-infused coffee in the country, and they're making sure we get our fix one cup at a time. It's cold brewed for 18 hours and then infused with the nitro the next day. A careful process that makes sure you enjoy your Nitro 7 experience to the hill. For coffee lovers out there, it's said that this method bumps up the caffeine content by up to 30%, but also it lessens the acidity and improves the taste. So you get a better kick and also indulge in a sweeter, thicker, smoother cup of cold brewed coffee. They have different items for every coffee lover and also for those folks who are not much into coffee as well. They have flavored cold brews that provide a nice variety, especially for those who are looking for a different taste for their coffee. They also have fruit flavored teas that are refreshing to enjoy. Usually, they serve Nitro 7 coffee in beer taps and it's such a joy to watch. But the current pandemic and strict lockdown policies have made them come up with a way to still let you enjoy your favorite Nitro 7 cold brew while staying safe at home. The Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea Be Your Own Barista Cold Brew Kit. If you've always wanted to be a barista and try mixing your own drinks, well, you got a chance to try that now with this portable kit that contains two bottles of their signature Nitro Black and two mix and flavorings of your choice. Hazelnut Caramel Mocha, Irish Cream, Chocolate Macadamia, and my personal favorite, Peppermint Mocha. I got my cold brew kit. Now let's go make some Nitro 7 cold brew coffee. So I got my glasses ready here. So the beer owned barista cold brew kit from Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea comes with this. Actually, a couple of these. This is the signature black coffee. And it also comes with a couple of mix-ins. There you go. And I got peppermint mocha and hazelnut caramel mocha right here. It's a nice plastic bottle. It's also recyclable. So after you've finished a whole or the whole coffee brew kit, you can always reuse it. Maybe use it for other drinks if you want to use it for I don't know, shampoos, you can do that as well. It's up to you, as long as you reuse the bottle, okay? I love the color scheme as well. I'm a big fan of the color orange. So how do you make your own nitro-infused cold brew coffee? But all you have to do is to open the bottles, of course. Then you have to pour in two parts of Nitro 7's nitro-infused signature black. And then you mix one part of a mix-in of your choice. You can also add ice. And if you want, you can mix it. Mmm, a nice strong coffee smell. Okay, so before we taste the iced mocha drinks, let's taste the signature coffee black first. Mmm, okay. Ah, it's got a bold flavor. And what I like about it is that sometimes, uh, especially if you're an avid coffee drinker, you will taste some fruity notes. This one, it's got a nice base taste, 
that's perfect if you want to mix it with flavors, okay? I was expecting it to be extremely bitter. It's not. It's actually got a nice, almost sweeter taste. Okay, got to put the mix in. Let's start with the hazelnut caramel mocha. Ooh, you can smell the nuttiness of the hazelnut already. Let's put one part in. Ooh, go taste it. I think it needs a little bit more. See, the best part of having your own cold brew kit from Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea is you can control the flavor. So you can make it sweeter. I think I forgot to shake the bottle. Okay, there, let's put some. Nice, I like this flavor. You can taste the sweetness of the caramel, but it's not sickly sweet that, you know, you'd, you'd feel it on your throat and hangs there. And yes, I'm kind of an expert when it comes to sweet stuff. Cause I'm sweet. <laughs> so bad. Sometimes if you take something that's really sweet, it kind of hangs in your throat and you can just feel it. This goes down easy. Flavor of the hazelnut is still there. This is perfect if you're having some something to eat as well. In Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea, they have some munchies available so you can always order and pair it with your coffee. Got some cakes, got some breads. This makes me want to get something to munch as well. I need something to munch on so I can even out my taste buds. I chose adobo. Mm. Okay, time to try my absolute favorite, peppermint mocha. Mm. Okay, so you definitely smell the peppermint, but it's not the type of mint that stings your nostrils. No, it's not. It's, it smells nice and subtle. Okay, let's prepare the drink. Nice. Time to taste it. Okay, of course I already know what to expect. Mmm. See, their subtle hint of mint, not overpowering the taste of the coffee or the chocolate or the brevet. Yes, the mix-ins contain half and half, half milk, half cream. It's called a brevet. And the difference between this and the hazelnut caramel mocha is that one's a little sweet. This one is a little more, it's not bitter, but it tastes a lot more chocolatey. And the subtleness of the mint taste is something that really gets me all the time. That's why I always order this. And this has gotten me focused on the task at hand a lot of times. Let's have another bite of the adobo, chicken adobo. Mm. And now if you know me, you know I love to experiment on stuff. And now something just clicked in me and just thought, what would happen if I combine both of them? Best part is we don't have to guess because we're gonna do it. Let's combine both of these flavors. Okay, so guys, I'll just give you a warning. The thing that I'm gonna do next is not part of the official flavor list of Nitro 7 coffee and tea. It's not part of the official instructions. It doesn't say that you combine both flavors. I'm just crazy like that. So, I'm gonna try it. Ta -da -da -da. And here's the peppermint mocha. Now let's taste it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it is nice. Okay, so you smell more of the caramel with this one, but you have the subtle flavor of the mint once you drink it. It hits you. I love it. We shall give this a new unofficial name. Henceforth and forth with, this shall officially be called the Nitro Torres. Refreshing. Nice and sweet. And now for the verdict. I'm sorry, I'll just keep on drinking this one. If you're looking for quality coffee that jolts your senses, but is kind to your taste buds, Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea's cold brew delivers on their promise of low acidity while staying naturally sweet. Surprisingly bold while going down smooth. It's perfect for a pick-me-up or in the morning or a refreshing beverage in the middle of the day. Or if you work nights. A perfect companion for those late OTs and red-eye shifts. These cold brew kits give you the luxury of enjoying ice-cold coffee while having the convenience of not having to leave your house for that Arabica indulgence. 
The flavored mix-ins are wonderful too, plus you get to control how your coffee will actually taste like. Overall, I recommend this for both serious coffee drinkers and casual chuggers who want more out of their cold brew coffee. If you want to purchase cold brew kits from Nitro 7 Coffee and Tea, all you got to do is check out their Facebook and Instagram pages that I will link on the description below. Have you tried Nitro Coffee already? How did you find it? Let's talk about it in the comments. And if you're craving for more yummy videos, why don't you check these ones out? Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you won't miss any updates. Remember, you can do so much even with just a little imagination. Eat well, or in this case, drink well. And I'll see you again next time.